How's it going, guys? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla with Tannen today. How are you guys doing? How are you doing, Tannen? I'm doing pretty well. How are you? Good, good. Um, we're jumping back into 2v2s. And before we jump into rank, we need to we need to shake that rust off a little bit. I'm going to actually use Bryn. I don't care. I, I, let's try it. Um, so what I'm going to be trying to do, basically, is we're going to... Play some friendlies. I'm gonna try to figure out who I want to main as my 2v2 main for when I'm playing with Tannen. Cause I think I feel like a 2v2 is you really need to kind of just stick with a good team that works. Find one that works. Lord Vrax is a good legend too. Um, yeah. I, I he's he's a bot that I'm fighting. That's what gave me the idea. Um. So we're gonna try this out. Bryn and Barraza do a few games. See if we can make it work. And yeah, hope you guys are all having a fantastic day, wherever you guys might be. Uh, might be doing some live streaming in the, this afternoon as well. Maybe do a little viewer lobby. Yep. Teros is really almost dead. Okay. Okay, Teros. Come on, Teros. Oh. I forgot there's no team damage, so this makes it quite a bit easier, but I'm gonna pretend that there is just for training purposes and try to not hit yeah, you. I barely survived. Still fighting for my life. Forgot to touch the wall. It has. <laughs> it does. It also happens where you do try and it still doesn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> the triple pogo. Using both the enemies. Man, I don't know how Scarlet went through my sig there, but... BMG never lies, right? Of course. Neutral sig! Again. Third. Oh, Scarlet! That's a wall. On the bottom of the sage. Alright, let's get some deep up. Oh, he's just... Ah, oh, ah, oh, ah. Oh. He gave up. That's so sad. It is. It makes me feel bad, too. All right, that's so that, that's working out all right. You know? Yeah. Is it me? Or did they change the skin on Bren, this one, to where the wings on the helmet are, like, larger now? I don't know. I don't really play Bryn, so I would. I feel like it looks better now with the with the wings being bigger, but I could be wrong. Like if they did, I don't read all the patch notes, but they have done minor cosmetic upgrades to the legends in the past. Yeah. So I wouldn't be completely blown away if they did. All right. So, real talk. What's your opinion on Rahala? Oh. Wait. What? You know These the... people are really good. Okay. Cora and Isaiah... Alright. They're the same clan name. Or the same name, almost. Yeah. I... They have really good team combos and friendly teams. Anyway, continue. I forgot even what I was talking about, dude. Don't worry about you it. said, real talk, what's your opinion on it? Oh. Yeah. I remember that part now, but I don't remember... Oh, what a throw. I don't remember what it was going to be, sorry. Oh, well, oh yeah, yeah, bad. yeah, yeah. What is your opinion on Epic Games buying Psyonix? Um, what do you think is going to happen to Rocket League now? I hope it still works with the Steam version, because 
and that they'll still allow Steam to have updates for it, because... Yeah, I can confirm that it will. They did say that it will be taken off of Steam, but if you already have it on Steam, you'll still get updates, and you'll still be able to get all the DLC or whatever they come out with. Interesting. But uh, it is going to go onto the Epic Store. Yeah, I think that they'll sell more copies for a while, and then it'll drop off and be less than what Steam is selling. All right, here's my theory. They're going to make it free to play, and I think it's going to be sooner rather than later. Ooh, that's that makes sense, actually. Fortnite's already free to play. This is Epic Games' model. They're going to go free to play, which, honestly, I have always wondered why Rocket League wasn't free to play. Uh, the reason Rocket League got popular in the first place was because it was free on PlayStation for like uh, a month or something. But anyway, free to play, uh, little cosmetic shop purchases, stuff like that. And, uh, you know, I think that's going to bring in a huge audience for the game. Yeah. Imagine actually, if Brawlhalla be... wasn't free to play. It'd be probably be dead. Yeah. For being free to play is a huge advantage. But I don't know, I could be wrong. Maybe they won't make it free to play. I really think the twenty dollar price tag hinders a lot of people from yeah. joint you know, trying it. Spear is really annoying in twos. Yeah. I feel bad. GG, dude, GG. You hyped those guys up, man. I, w I was expecting more, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not trying to they're, BM they're them, dub but... They might be somebody else that I'm thinking of, but I run into them in friendly twos all the time. But... Mm. He had a shine avatar, that's pretty cool. Or, uh, not a shine. I, d I don't remember what that one is, but... Yeah, feels good, man. Brahalla. All right, enough about the future of uh, Rocket League. What do you think the future of Brahalla is, like, in the next year? What's Where's Brahalla going to be a year from now? I actually have a few, like, theories. All right. Because it's weird. Like, I don't think that they can just keep adding new weapons. I think that New they... skins, new legends, new weapons. I, th I think new legends are great, but uh, new keep adding new weapons on the same schedule that they are adding them. I think it's a bit too much. I think they have to finish some old weapon combinations or like make a public statement about if they're going to use those weapon combinations or not. Because... Uh, looking at you, bow and scythe. Yeah. Or bow and lance is what I really want. But, um... I feel like they should keep working on that or, like I said, make some public statements about if they're not going to... I don't think they want to give away their secrets of, like, what's coming out in the future, if they are yeah. working on that. I I just hope that crossplay comes out, and I think that that'll keep the game alive. It will, um, but, so instead of releasing new weapon or new legends, new skins, what would you rather have them release out after crossplay? Um, like, after. do you want to see, like, a story mode or just more other game modes? Like, a lot of people think that that would be nice. I don't know that I would like a story mode. I want them to fix the bots, maybe work on some of the bot AI, because right now, like, even the hardest setting on the bots, like... Oh, they're, yeah, they're, they're dumb. Really... No offense yeah. if you think they're hard, but... Compare it to uh, the bots in Super Smash Bros. They're way better, dude. Yeah. Like they, like, they mess me up. The bots in Brawlhalla can do everything frame perfectly, but they take a while to, like, figure out a The AI is everything. not not there. Yeah, I would I would like them to fix the AI next. It's my thing. Sweet. I've noticed these guys stay on the ground a lot. Makes for great sweeping. Oh. Came to back you up and he was already dead.
Yeah, I don't know, man. Brawlhalla, it's a great game where it is. I just would like to see them up the graphics. And what I mean by that is not the characters or the, the fighting. I'm talking about the stage and the background. Um, it would be nice to see more weapon effects like you see in Shin Sakai Koji and stuff like that. But for everyone, you know, they need to up their... What do you call it? Just the overall product. Make it higher quality. Don't make it look like it was made by an indie dev anymore. You, you know, make it... Uh, just make it better looking. Look at the background on the stage. I mean, yeah, sure, it's all right, but I have I've seen mods made by fans that are better looking than the like the maps than the maps that are in the game, like the official maps. You know what I mean? Yeah. He's he's a goner. Yeah. There's multiple. Uh, there's also better looking weapon skins, better looking sig effects, like. If the community can create it, why are not the de developers of the game? Like, what are they doing every day, eight hours a day? Do they work eight hours a day? If they if they are, what are they doing? Making a skin, like how long does it take to make a new skin? I mean, they only make like one or two new skins a week, if that, maybe every couple weeks. So if it takes somebody a couple weeks to make a skin, what is everybody else working on? Like, I'm just, I know they're doing esports stuff, but what about developing the actual game, making it more, making it better, constantly improving yeah. it? It's like Michelangelo only finishing half of his painting or just stopping with a rough outline and calling it good and then just, I don't know, man, like they just, they need- I think a lot of the time when coming with skins is that there's so many colors that they have to do all that. That is true. Weapons. It does take a long time to make a skin, I'm sure. But I see zero progress on anything else. Where's the more clan feature, like where it's like you can actually match make against clans in game, or like that would be awesome. Where's where's like I want to be able to use any color of uh, in, uh, custom lobby two v twos. You can only be red and blue. Yet oh, in yeah. friendlies or ranked, you can do any color. So it's clearly already in the game, and yet they just don't let you in custom lobbies. I don't. I just don't get it. Um, just up the pro production of the game, though. Make it make more cool graphics, more more epic skins, basically. But I don't know. The game is free, so I don't mind if they make more pay to you know more items in the shop. I don't mind. The game's free. That's how they make money. The one thing I want is another Diana skin because I just want another one in the shop that I can. She has quite a few, but yeah. I'm sure she will get another one because she's popular legend. Or like an epic skin with animated stuff because yes. she's so popular. I feel like a lot of people would buy that. They need to make epic skins faster. Because they're only the making most... one like every few months. That's not enough. Every, yeah. every patch should have an epic skin in my opinion. I know that's asking a lot, but the game needs it. How many more people would play this game if it just looked cooler? You know? Right, yeah. The gameplay is perfect. The mechanics, the core is beautiful. They created a really fun game. Let's just make it look good now. This stage looks pretty good. This is one of the newer stages. I love it. And the music stage. is good. They're doing better on the more like newer stuff. Did I, did I just save him? I think so. My bad. Why not go back to the old stages and just make them updated? Make them beautiful blow us away with some awesome art. I know there's a ton of talent that works there. All right, I've been complaining about BMG for like 20 minutes. I'm going to stop now. You guys, <laughs> I, I need to make a rant video. Do you think I should? Maybe they would listen. Uh, you... Like, I never criticize BMG, but maybe I should because I'm in a position to where they may listen to me a little because I kind of represent the community. 100,000 subscribers, they might listen. Maybe. Um... They may not do anything, but at the list, they follow me on Twitter. That's all I need to say. <laughs> they do? Yes. That's, That's all great. I need to say. So I think I think if I made a video ranting, they'd probably just blacklist me and not even watch it. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. I need, to, I need to write down all my thoughts. You guys in the comments, do you hear me? Do you hear what we're saying? I would love to hear your guys' take on the direction of Brahalla and where do you think that, that it needs to be going? I actually feel like I should make a video on this now. Maybe I will. We'll, we'll, we'll see. Maybe? Maybe.
just like things that I think they need to do to, to make the game better. And I would love to hear what you guys would would say because maybe I'll I'll use some of your points. I like Tannen's idea of having a better roadmap, being more transparent with what they're working on or will or won't work on and why or why not. That would be nice. Yeah. They do the, the weekly streams or the bi-weekly. Which is a, a lot more than most devs do for t saying what they're going to work on, but... It seems like a lot of the time all they do is talk about the esports too, and I don't really care that much about it. I do like follow it somewhat, but... The esports in Brahalla is nothing like it is in Rocket League, though. And I, I just, um... I want to know more about the game. Not Like, what are you doing to make the game better, not just the esports scene? I know that that's important to work on, and I think they should, but... What about the rest of the games? What about the rest of us that don't care about the pro scene? Which is the majority of Brahalla. I'm sorry, they, they, they don't want me to say that probably, but I think majority of Brahalla players are pretty casual. Yeah, I'm one of the players that really likes the pro scene, but not everybody's that way. I do like it, and I, I do want them to keep growing it. It is fun, um, definitely. But I want to see them put just as much focus in actually making the game better as they do seem to focus on just the esports. Because um, that's like all I ever see them tweet about. It's all they talk about half the time in their dev streams. Maybe there's nothing else to talk about, but if so, what are you working on again? Yeah. What are you guys doing in the office? What are your programmers uh, working on, you know? What are, what are the actual developers that program the game working on? That's what I want to know. Dude, Yumiko Sky, or Gold Forge is looking really nice. Yeah, that does look really clean. Oh, yes! Did that just happen? That was I, sick. Ah, uh, yeah. Double recovery, it always works. Oh, he DC'd and he was the last one. He had to five stock right, us. On, let's, let's pull off some crazy team combos on the bot. Wait, All right, he's got to get on the stage first. All right, maybe, you know what? Screw it up. Oh, jump right by me. Bot, what are you doing? I don't know, dude. That's what you're talking about. They need to make the AI better, too. Yeah. You don't even know what the bot does, because, dude, I... <laughs> Have you ever been like waiting in the queue and then the bot does some really stupid funny thing like glitching out? Like one time uh, this morning the bot just started spamming left and right really fast and he, he was trying to and I was just standing still next to him not moving and he couldn't figure out what to do. It was yeah, so funny. That happened, to be, that happened to be earlier today too. I was fighting in experimental. I was warming up and the, the dude <laughs> left after like the first two stocks and then I just stood inside yeah, of the yeah. boss. You just stand there and it freaks out the bot, dude. They don't know what to do if you just stand still. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I was I was so uh, disappointed I wasn't recording when I saw that happen because it's it is hard to reproduce, but it was funny. I was like, man, my viewers would have thought that was funny. Oh well, you just have to take our word for it that the bots are possessed sometimes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, this will probably be our last game. We we've been. Uh, yeah. Bad modding BMG so long that the time has been flying, dude. BMG. Right, you guys know that I love BMG. I mean, I love Brahalla, I should say. Yeah, I love Brahalla. As I, well. I, I'm a fan of the devs. I am a fan of the devs for the most part. It really made me sad when Raiden left, but I think he left on his own accord. But he he was a really good community outreach person. Ooh, that Ouch, dude. Nice. Cannon ground pound is really strong. Nice in there. Yeah, that was really good. The the, the this this team is uh, not too bad, dude. For our last game, we're gonna have to earn this. Yeah, I just don't want the devs to hate me when I finally get around to becoming a pro myself. No, they they I'm sure they don't mind constructive criticism at all because they know at the end of the day we're only saying these things because we want the game to be better and to succeed. You know. Yeah. And we're just giving them opinions on what we think they should do. They don't have to listen. And they you know, they know that it's, it's we 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 mean we mean well. We mean well. Slim Faye is 
think she's on fire, dude. Oh, he she got saved. I'll save you. Yeah, Linfei needs to die. What? I don't even know how I died. I just okay. I saw a boom and then I was just dead. All right, I'm gonna take it's out okay. Linfei. We're, we're coming back from this. Probably, dude. I I have faith. There we go, there we go. Ooh, team combo. Nice double. Yeah. Alright, if we take out the Isaiah. Oh no. I can I can one v one then Faye, I'm pretty sure, but Yeah, I can one v one the Isaiah. All right, all right, let's bring it back. Bringing it back. Bringing it back, baby. Core is broken six. Spike on me. Ow. Maybe I shouldn't do that. Such a dire si- Ooh. Oh! That was almost the greatest thing we've ever done. Almost. Somehow she broke out of it. No. Oh, oh, oh my was, gosh. That was Firestar crazy. is a god at Lin Fei, dude. That was the best down sig double kill I've ever seen. GG, dude, with her. Dang, that was sick. Yeah. So, lesson that I can learn from that is when you're down there on the side, I should probably just stay on the stage. Yeah. Because that way, if you die... At least I'm still there. Right. Hey, level 21 core, baby. Just leveled up. Nice. Nice. All right. That was good warm up. I think we do this a little more than we hop into rank. We'll be we'll be on fire, dude. We got it. Yeah. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please drop a like if you did. Be sure to subscribe. Um, Tannen, thank you for playing with me again as always. And uh, of course. Yeah, guys. Hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, guys. See you, guys.